Hey, this is Chad with Monday Scientific. Today we're going to show you how to remove and uh, add a fluorescent cube to your fluorescent cube turret on your Olympus BX2 microscope. Okay, on this Olympus, this is a BX41. Um, so this procedure is going to be the same for the 40, the 41, the 50, the 51, the 60, the 61, etc. So you're going to take your three millimeter Allen wrench. Um, if you don't have it in your microscope, you can get one from your local hardware store. On the, uh, let's see here, right side of the scope, if you're looking at the scope, you're gonna put the three mil in there, and then you're gonna loosen this off, maybe three turns, and that turret's gonna pull right out. I like to set it down, face down like that. We're gonna get the microscope out of the way for this. Okay, so you're gonna have your fluorescent filter cubes um, already in this turret, and then we have a loose one here. We'll show you how to take them out and put them in. So you'll take your same three millimeter Allen wrench and then this screw hole right here, you're gonna put the wrench in there, loosen it maybe two turns and this will lift right out. So you wanna put it um, with the writing downward or upside down uh, and then the mirror, when you look into this filter cube is at a diagonal. So there's no, there's no filter here. So there's gonna be a filter on the bottom, filter on the front and a diagonal. Okay, so let's, uh, now that we've taken it out, we can use that same one. I have a different one here. Um, we're gonna go ahead and put this filter back in. So the empty slot, you're gonna just slide it down. You'll feel it click in and tighten it up. It's very simple. Sometimes you'll see these filter holders. These are just placeholders that are sent from the manufacturer. Um, we can take those out if they're in the way. Uh, just same procedure, just loosen the screw, and then they've got a little notch, they pull straight out. All right, so now that we have the cube uh, uninstalled and reinstalled, uh, make sure everything turns really nice, and um, we'll go ahead and reassemble it. Okay, um, we've got all the cubes in the cube turret that we're gonna put in for the day. We're gonna slide it in the dovetail here it slides right back in. Um, it, it usually goes in very smooth. I'm kind of at an awkward angle. So um, make sure it's inserted and pushed all the way back. And then put your three millimeter Allen wrench back in that hole. And just tighten it up and just give it a little wiggle to make sure it doesn't come out and you're ready to go. Thanks for viewing this video. If you have any questions, reach out to us at info at mondaymicroscope.com or you can visit us online at mondaymicroscope.com. If you're looking for any of these accessories, filter cubes, we recommend filter cubes from Chroma. Um, you can reach out and find those on our marketplace, microscopemarketplace.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much.